I'm starting today's video downstairs in the pews right on the center aisle here. In just a moment, I'll be upstairs at the organ and play a piece for you. This is a little experiment, actually. I've talked before about the big trumpet stop that we have on this instrument, the festival trumpet. It has always been fairly big for the organ. It takes full organ to accompany it, which is a lot of fun for big occasions, weddings, processions, Easter, occasions like that. But truth be told, now when you play chords on it, it hurts my ears just a little bit when seated at the organ console. It's still fine when you play just solo melodies, like for a trumpet tune of some kind. But playing chords on it, at least at the organ console, is a bit much. Dr. Kojal and I have not had time yet to come in here and play the organ for each other while the other one walks around the room, which is what we really need to do. So I'm using this video here by myself as a little experiment to see what the trumpet sounds like when chords are played on it from downstairs. Of course, when people return to this room and sit in these pews, even with our hard floor and our hard surfaces, the acoustics will change just a little bit. And so that'll be another occasion that we'll have to figure out uh, what the organ sounds like with people in the room. But for now, I'm gonna play an ancient English piece of music called the Agincourt Hymn by John Dunstable. It starts and ends with a big fanfare on the big trumpet and the hymn or uh, chorale melody is in the middle. <laughs> 